Now that you know how to schedule an appointment, I'm going to share a top secret hack to feel the spirit even stronger. Finding a deceased family member to take to the temple. <laughs> no, not like that. In the temple, we act as a proxy for people who have passed on and never had a chance to go through the temple on their own. The deceased can then choose to accept these ordinances that we perform for them. That's some pretty solid missionary work if I do say so myself. Finding a name might seem hard and intimidating, but through the magic of family history work and modern technology, it's never been easier to do. First, you need to download the Family Search Tree app on your phone. Once you've done that, sign in with your username and password. Or you can even sign in with your Gospel Library credentials. Once you've signed in, you'll be able to see your family tree. This shows you all of the family history that has been done in your family. There is so much you can do in this app. But let's keep it simple and focus on finding a name to take with us on our next temple trip. Find the button in the bottom menu titled Temple. This is where you will see the names of family members whose names you've reserved to take to the temple. If this is your first time, you'll see a button titled Ordinances Ready. Click it. You will then choose what type of ordinance you are looking for. The app will then search your family tree for anybody that has not had this ordinance completed. Once it's done searching, click to view people. Select the person you wish to do the ordinance for and click continue. You'll then have a QR code ready in your app. Take it to the temple and have one of the patrons scan it to print off your ordinance card. How sweet is that? Now that you have all this knowledge, get to work on providing your deceased family members the blessings of the temple. They've been waiting. This is delicious.